The financial sector is still largely recovering from the banking crisis, but if you're looking for stability and a good return, then custodian banks could be worth looking at. We think that custody banking is a great business, and we assign a wide moat to each of the three focused custody banks that we cover, BNY Mellon, State Street, and Northern Trust. What custodial banks do is take a custody of and provide safekeeping for financial assets like stocks and bonds for institutional investors like pension funds and mutual funds. The custodian banks typically also provide related back office services like recording settlement of sales and purchases, tracking day-end values, and collecting dividends. While these tasks may seem mundane, we actually see them as very modi. It's a business where intangible assets and switching costs are very important. It's critical that custodial services be performed reliably and accurately and customers are loath to switch providers because of the risk of disrupting their businesses. We see each of the custody banks that we cover as close to fairly valued right now. They're trading at a small discount to our fair value but not enough to warrant a four-star rating. You know, still there are good investments to keep an eye on. They're above average dividend payers for financial services because they're so well capitalized they're able to pay out more than 30 percent of their income as dividends as opposed to the 30 percent cap that we see on most financial services. They tend to also be very stable businesses and we expect their returns to increase materially over the next several years as interest rates eventually increase.